guys, it's Extreme Strategy here, and today we're checking out another mod for Total War Warhammer 3. This mod is the Lords of the Night Conrad and Sylvanian Levy mod, which adds Conrad Van Karstein, as well as two Sylvanian units. Conrad Van Karstein is known by many names, including Conrad the Butcher, Conrad the Bloody, and Conrad the Beast. He was extremely cruel by the standards of even a vampire count, and was also completely insane. He also had a never-ending thirst for blood, which made him extremely dangerous, because not only was he a violent lunatic, but he was never satisfied with the blood that he drank. Conrad Van Karstein's attributes are melee expert and insane, and his abilities are Undead, Sword of Waldenhof, Base Weapon Damage plus 50%, Armor Piercing Weapon Damage plus 50%, Red Fury, Armor Piercing Weapon Damage plus 25%, Charge Bonus plus 20%, and Vigor Per Second minus 1%, Summon Wolves, Summon Bats, Charmed Shield, and Bat Form, where Conrad Van Karstein transforms into a swarm of bats, form offers flight, but also offers a good target for enemy fire. And then inside combat, Conrad Van Karstein is going to immediately transform into a swarm of bats, and he will come flapping into the peasant mob while summoning another group of fell bats to attack the Bretonian Lord. And Conrad Von Karstein as a swarm is going to strike the peasant mob time and again until eventually he turns back into vampire form, at which point he will summon some dire wolves to come charging into the back lines of the Bretonian mob, resulting in all of the peasant mobs routing, and then Conrad Von Karstein is going to begin to attack the Bretonian Lord, striking him time and again with his two swords, easily being able to bring him down. Next up are the Sylvanian Levy. Their attributes are shielded and human, and then inside combat they'll come charging right into the peasant mob and begin to strike them with their swords time and again. And it'll not be very hard for the Sylvanian Levy to overwhelm the peasant mob, resulting in all the peasant mob routing. And then lastly are the Sylvanian Archers. Their attributes are human and good range. And inside combat they will get the enemy within range and then they will draw back their bows and begin to fire arrows into the peasant mob. And they will continue to fire volleys of arrows, doing massive massive damage to the peasant mob. And when the peasant mob come charging into the Sylvanian Archers to begin to engage them inside a melee, their leadership will be so low that the peasant mob will rout only moments after engaging the Sylvanian Archers. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe for more content like this. Also, go check out the Discord server and subscribe to this mod. Links both those in the description below. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video and hope you enjoy the rest of your day.